Hey everybody, this is a tag video from Gonna Be So Healthy's channel from Adrian. Hello, hi Adrian. The tag is called Who Are You? Who are you? Who, 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 who? <laughs> There's some intro for you. Um, so let's just get right into it. The first question is, what is your YouTube username? I think you'll find it right about there-ish. I'm just being an ass. I've just started the video and I'm being an ass. <laughs> okay, my YouTube name is JR's Basement. And it's spelt the way it is because YouTube won't let you put periods and commas and slashes or anything like that in your name. So the J and the R represent um, my name and my sister's name combined together and then basement. Second question, what is your real name? My real name is Jolene. And where am I from? I, sorry, not where am I from? The question is, where do you live? I live in Northern Ontario. And what is the best thing about your town? The best thing about my town is leaving it. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> um, one of the best things about my town that I've noticed is its nature and the trees. My town does have a lot going for it, but the trees are my answer. What do you want to accomplish? What do you want to accomplish on YouTube? Well, I created JR's Basement because I wanted to track my weight loss journey on video. I wanted to become a part of the weight loss community. And uh, before I decided to sign up under that name and uh, make my own videos for myself, I had seen many other success stories and I thought to myself, man, I want to be one of those people. I want to be able to be sitting at my goal and see my progress from day one to where I am. And if that's something that inspires people along the way, motivates them, or somebody learns something, then cool. Also, I, I started the channel because I thought it would help me with my commitment to my health and to going to the gym. Another thing is I'm interested in the YouTube Partner Program. I don't qualify for it, but I think it's pretty cool because when you look at famous YouTubers like Shane Dawson, The Wine Cone, Michael Buckley, just to name a few people, they have pretty cool jobs. I mean, they get paid pretty much to be their own boss, put out their own content, and they love doing what they do. Now, it's not, I'm not saying that it's a goal for me to reach that, I'm just saying if that were to happen, that would be pretty freaking sweet and I could quit, quit my job. <laughs> so it's just something I'm curious about, I like to research it and things like that. Really though, I think all in all, what I want to accomplish is getting down in size, uh, reaching my goals, and um, there's some other things, but they change day to day. So I'll just stick with that because the answer is long enough. Five, what is your favorite food in the whole wide world? My favorite food in the whole wide world is pizza, preferably Canadian which is bacon, pepperoni, and mushroom. <clears throat> Excuse me, I don't know, my voice is going weird for a minute there. Uh, number six, one week exploring France or one week on the beach in Mexico? I choose France. I've been to Paris once before and it was on a day trip, which was sweet. It was nice to do that, you know, got to see the Eiffel Tower, got to see a few sights and 
you know, it was a taste. So to have a whole week would be just that much more fun and exciting. Number seven, do you have kids? No, I don't have kids. I have a soon to be two year old nephew that I'm crazy about. He's like my favorite family member. I love everything about him except for his crappy diapers, but that's not really his fault. <laughs> um, if I don't have kids, do I have pets? No, I do not have a pet. Therefore, I must do a celebrity impersonation. Whew. Okay, you know what? I looked at that question and I thought, man, this is going to be so fun. And I had about 10 different ideas of silly things that amused me and I found hilarious. But I'm just going to narrow it down to one. This is something that my sister often will tell me when she sees my hair the way it is because of these little bits. Um, this is my microphone that I'm going to use. I'm just going to randomly sing a song here. Black, black heart, how could you offer more? And that's it. Basically, if you don't know who that is, that is uh, David Usher. Uh, very popular in Canada. And uh, my sister and I just, she teases me about me kind of looking like him because his hair kind of does this sort of thing like it's layered and this and that so <laughs> there you go uh, number eight what is one thing you love about yourself physically or internally physically I like my face I like this general area I like what's going on there um, I also like my ankles and <laughs> Internally, uh, what I like about myself is that I can keep myself amused. <laughs> Number nine, what is your favorite song? This is such a tough question because I love music and even if you asked me what is my favorite song from my favorite band, even that would be hard. I'd have to say that currently my favorite song is... Bruno Mars, The Lazy Song. Today I swear I'm not doing anything. <laughs> kind of screwed it up. Yeah, it's my favorite, but I screwed it up. I'd say my favorite part of that song is the no, 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 no. And the yeah, 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 yeah. Simple things make me happy. <laughs> I'd say one of my all-time favoritest of favorite songs, if I had a life soundtrack, this would have to be on it, is Silverchair's song after all these years, and it goes like this. Breathe in the night, that crusted, tired sunrise, born again the day, brings young naivety. Thank you. I have to cut myself off because I would sing the entire song. I love to sing, but we don't want to go there. Um, if you're curious about the songs, I will link them below. Whoever's curious, whoever's watching, below. And number 10 is if you could do anything this week, anything in the world, I'm saying this slowly because I have my camera screen shrunk down and it's covering up the questions. <laughs> what would you do? I would go to Hawaii and I would boogie board, learn how to surf, pick my own pineapple, learn how to hula, go to a luau and do every other kind of uh, touristy thing that I haven't mentioned. and. You know, I'd like to see quirky things like movie locations where Fifty First Dates was filmed, stuff like that. So thanks for creating this tag. It was fun. Uh, glad I got to participate.
whoever else watches that doesn't know where this tag came from, feel free to participate. Check out Adrian's channel. Holla! Just gave you a shout out. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> okay, so I guess that's it. Thank you for watching and listening, and we'll see you soon. Bye for now.